Hey there, it's Ryan. Today, we're diving into a game-changing topic for all you phone enthusiasts out there. Unlocking your Freedom Pop phone from its network restrictions. Ever felt stuck because your phone just won't accept a different carrier's SIM card? Well, you're not alone. Many of us have been there trying to switch networks, only to be greeted by that annoying lock message. But don't worry, because I've got your back. In this video, I'll walk you through some simple yet effective methods to free your phone from those pesky carrier locks. And guess what? These tricks work on both Android and iOS devices. So whether you're a fan of sleek iPhones or love the versatility of Androids, I've got something for everyone. The best part? This isn't just about Freedom Pop. The methods I'm going to show you are universal. They work on any carrier, in any country, and with any brand. Think of Freedom Pop as just an example. The world of unlocked phones is now at your fingertips. So grab your phone, get comfortable, and let's unlock the full potential of your device together. Let the freedom begin. Now just a quick heads up before we dive in. This info is all about using it the right way. It's for folks who own their phones and just want to switch carriers. We're not here to encourage anything shady like messing with security on phones that aren't yours. Always stay on the right side of the law and respect others' rights. And of course, we're playing by YouTube's rules and community standards. All right, now that we've got that covered, let's get started. Quick note here, remember, the unlock services we're talking about mainly work in first world countries. If you can't access these services or prefer not to use them, don't worry, we've got you covered. We offer 250 unlocks every week for our viewers. Here's how you can be one of them. Leave a like, subscribe to our channel, stay updated with all our latest tips and tricks, and lastly, comment, drop down your phone model, like Samsung S22, your IMEI number, and the country you're in. That's it. Once you complete these steps, you're automatically in the running for a free unlock. So make sure you follow each step to enter our weekly draw. Good luck. Let's dive straight into how to use Carrier Switcher, a handy online tool for unlocking your phone. First, you'll need to visit carrierswitcher.com. Once there, look for the green button to start the process. After clicking the green button, you'll be prompted to enter your name and email. This step is crucial as it's how they'll assign the order to you. Make sure to use a real email address because you'll receive a confirmation code through it. Next up, you'll need to select your device's manufacturer, like Samsung or Apple. This helps the service identify the specific unlocking method for your phone. Now the key part, entering your IMEI number. You might be wondering, what's an IMEI and where do I find it? Well, it's a unique code for your phone, and you can usually find it by dialing star hashtag 06 hashtag on your phone's keypad. The IMEI will then display on your screen. Once you've entered the IMEI, it's important to confirm that you're acting within the terms of service and that the device you're unlocking isn't stolen property. After agreeing to the terms, tap continue to finalize the process. You'll see a confirmation that your unlock request is ready, and they'll also send a confirmation email to you. In the email, you'll receive instructions and an access key. This key is pretty versatile. You can use it multiple times for unlimited downloads. Lastly, for instructions on how to use the access key, just follow the steps provided on the page. This will guide you through the final stages of unlocking your phone with Carrier Switcher. If you're looking for other options to remove the carrier lock from your phone, there are several methods you can consider. One of the most straightforward ways is to contact your current carrier directly. They can unlock your phone, especially if you fulfilled the terms of your contract or paid off the device in full. It's a good idea to check your carrier's policy on unlocking, as each one has its own set of rules and procedures. Another option is to use a third-party unlocking service. These services can often unlock a phone quickly and efficiently. However, it's important to choose a reputable service to avoid scams. Look for services with good reviews and a track record of successful unlocks. You can also unlock your phone using software designed for this purpose. This method requires a bit more technical know-how, as you'll need to use specific software compatible with your phone model. Be cautious and ensure you're using software from a trustworthy source to avoid damaging your phone. Lastly, some phones can be unlocked using a code. You can obtain these codes from your carrier or a third-party service. Once you have the code, you'll enter it into your phone following specific instructions based on your phone model. Remember, 
Unlocking your phone should always be done ethically and legally. Avoid methods that seem dubious or too good to be true, as they could potentially harm your phone or violate laws. Stick with the tried and true methods for a safe and successful unlock. Thanks for sticking with us through this guide. If you found this video helpful, remember to hit that like button. It really supports the channel. Don't forget to subscribe too, so you won't miss out on more useful tips and tricks. And hey, if everything worked out for you, or if you have any questions, drop a comment below. We love hearing from you and are here to help. Until next time, keep unlocking your tech potential.